Magnolia found herself in an animal shelter. <laughs> she came in as a stray, but I knew there was something special about this dog. My name is Sarai, and this is Magnolia's story for GeoBeats. I'm the co-founder of Wolf Mother Canine Rescue Services. We work specifically with behaviorally challenged and euthanasia listed dogs. Hey buddy. Staff reported that they had seen consistent high aggressive responses with this dog. <laughs> They couldn't even feed her without moving her to the opposite side of the kennel. Hey, it's all right. Every interaction with staff with her was very negative. Magnolia did display the same responses with me. Before I had met her, she hadn't been out of her kennel in weeks. We can only imagine the kind of toll physically and emotionally and psychologically that takes on a high energy, high drive dog. So we increase the positive associations they have with things. Most of these dogs do have a deadline, unfortunately. What is it? Come here, mama. Good girl. It's a good girl. What's she doing? What? Oh, what's a good girl? Yeah, I know. Yeah, what's she doing? What's she doing? Ready? Get it. Oh, that's a good girl. Good girl. <laughs> what is she doing? What is she doing? Ready? Ready? Yes! Oh! Good girl. Good girl. Within days, I had this dog out of the kennel. Hey, what are we doing? <laughs> oh. Little by little, we started expanding her social circle to other staff and volunteers as well. We saw oh an incredible God. dog blossom. She's a love bug. She is so affectionate. <laughs> you see such a different side to this dog. She is wonderful, beautiful, social. You wouldn't believe it, you know, seeing her in the kennel initially. She is such a great example for everyone to see. It often doesn't take very big, extreme changes. <laughs> what are you doing right now? Just consideration, patience, and empathy can go such a long way. Kindness is the way we're going to change this world. And Magnolia is the perfect example of that. Everyone was rooting for this dog. Mm, good girl. We found a potential adopter. The journey was over 800 miles to meet up with Andrew and Evelyn. And they adopted Magnolia. Good morning. <laughs> She's currently living in Los Angeles with two other dogs. Go. <laughs> she is having a blast. <laughs>